Hello and welcome to today's practice. We will work with our lower back, releasing unnecessary tension and finding more mobility. So go ahead and find yourself standing and with a breath in, bring your arms above your head and slide them to your heart chakra to set the intention for today. And gentle bow to your heart with the next breath in. Go ahead and interlace your fingers, stretch them forward in front of you and open your chest with a gentle arch. Breathe out and bow forward and breathe in, open your chest again. With the next breath out, allow yourself to open your legs a little bit wider if that feels more comfortable, allowing a little bit more mobility in our lower back and letting our pelvis move gently forward and gently back when we go forward. And breathe in when you arch, breathe out bend all the way forward place your arms behind your head and let the weight stretch your neck here and we're gonna go to the right all around through the back and forward breathe in when you go around at the back breathe out forward finding a little bit more mobility in our rib cage area in our mid back opening up your chest and we're gonna reverse to the left take your time listen to what pace your body feels like doing if you need to go slower please do so opening that chest going together with the breath in when you arch and breath out when you go forward and stretch all the way up Release your hands and we're going to go and step, open our legs forward and bring a little bit more circulation into our pelvis. Just describing gentle circles with our pelvis. Just two more, yeah? Letting your chest go, bringing blood flow to our pelvis and reverse to the other side. Allow your body to do what feels good. Bringing more circulation to our pelvis. And come back to the center. Stretch your knees, interlace your fingers behind you. Open that chest. Stretch even more and gently bowing forward, bending our knees, we go slow to release this tension in our lower back, bend forward and feel free to stretch your knees or keep them gently bent, releasing the tension in our lower back. We're going to go and place our arms slightly to the right to find a nice stretch in our left a lower back area here. Allow yourself to breathe to the back of your ribs and come back to the center and move to the left side gently. Let go. Allow your belly to pour onto your thigh. Again, feel free to bend your knees gently, whatever feels good for your body and for your lower back. Coming back to the center, placing two heels, breathe in, breathe out and placing two heels close to one another. We're gonna find a nice opening in our chest. Here, listen to your body. Breathe deeply, you can stay here or place your left arm on your right ankle and Find a little bit more opening in that chest, very gently, release, find yourself hanging upside down again. 
breathe in, place the heels of your hands close to one another and open your left arm to the ceiling. Feel free to stay there. Check the level of your hips and open that chest to the ceiling. Breathe and unwind, release your spine. And slowly move your heels and toes closer, bringing our legs closer to one another. And going down to our knees. I'm gonna go and stretch a little bit further. Feel free to bring your heels together and take your arms a little further. A happy puppy stretch. Here you can always place a brick under your forehead, under your chest, something that feels comfortable. Allowing our chest to open up, stretching our shoulder blade, our upper chest area. Now we're gonna find a gentle curve here before we're gonna go further. And find a nice twist, placing right arm through the left. You can stay here or stretch that arm above you. Again, here if you place a yoga brick under your shoulder, which will elevate your body, which will make it a little bit easier on the twist. So check in if that feels better and release the stretch and open your left arm and thread the needle and you can stay here place the brick under your left shoulder if that feels good or go a little further and release that upper arm opening your right armpit to the ceiling and of course, don't forget to breathe deeper. Letting go. Letting go of unnecessary tension. Walk your arms back. And shift your weight all the way to the back. We're gonna find a nice arch here, sending our pelvis forward. Feel free to go to a full camel if that feels good. And bend your hips back down to your heels and we're gonna go for a few more like that. Bring your pelvis up, open your chest even more. Keep bringing your pelvis gently forward and bring it back down. Last one, we're gonna go for another stretch, opening that chest, opening your whole spine all the way to the top of your head. Breathe deeper and bring your pelvis down. Tuck your toes and we're going for a down facing dog, finding few breaths here, stretching our hamstrings stretching our spine, elongating our spine and stepping with the right leg forward, left knee on the ground. And we're going to breathe in, keep your arms together or open and shift our weight back, finding a nice stretch in the hamstrings and in our lower back here. And we're going to go back and forth four times here. This is the third one, open your chest and shift your weight back. Very good to release unnecessary tension in our glutes here and in our hamstrings. And to tighten our lower back. Open that chest and bring, bend it forward. Pour your chest onto your thigh and 
the last one. Finding a nice stretch in our inside our hips as well. 